people and welcome back to another vlog sorry guys i'm currently trying to get my trainers on as i'm heading out on a spontaneous date with my cousin-in-law there's this amazing like brunch place in mailbox birmingham for those that don't know and it's called medicine oh it's so nice so so nice and me and her tend to go for like little dates and whatnot and catch-ups there meet her and my little baby cousin so i'm gonna go meet her now and we're gonna go there and have a little catch up so i thought why not have a bit of a vlog today so yeah we're just doing a bit of chill vibes we're literally doing like leggings hoodies kind of um vibe because she was already out at the time that we had arranged it like it was that spontaneous so yeah i'm just matching her fit today and um yeah i'm gonna go from there bye so guys i thought i'd implement a word into each vlog that i do today's word is zephaniah 3 17 the lord your god is with you the mighty warrior who saves he will take great delight in you in his love he will no longer rebuke you but will rejoice over you with singing So after we went for our brunch, I am actually obsessed with this place in Melbox and it's called the Kitchen Gallery. It's a little showroom with like a bunch of kitchens. So we popped into there for a bit and had a bit of a browse around. And honestly guys, it made me want to change my whole apartment all over again. Um, but yeah, just thought I'd bring you guys in on that also. So I'm back from being out with my cousin-in-law and my baby cousin. It was such a nice, spontaneous little date. Other than that, today I was literally just going to do my administration stuff that I'd mentioned in my last vlog. Um, if you haven't watched that, go watch it, guys. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to get on with that and literally have a chill day to myself. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to be um, doing some grocery shopping with my mom. So I'll probably take you guys along with me and my mom as we go out to do that. And yeah, I'll probably catch up with you guys in a bit. So as you guys can see, it's a whole day later. I woke up and decided to make myself a peppermint tea. As you guys know, I'm obsessed with different teas, so I poured myself one. And then we're going to sit down in a moment and I'm going to fill you guys in on what I've done with my morning thus far. Good morning, lovely people. It is the next day, as you can probably tell. Um, yesterday was a bit of it was just like a scattered day for me and i was just like it doesn't feel for natural to vlog yesterday so i didn't feel like let me just bring y'all into the day or whatever um so not long ago, well i woke up quite a while ago to be fair i woke up this morning but i woke up this morning and um started by doing a bit of rendering i put the videos on the screen i don't know if you guys enjoy that but i put a few of the videos and pictures and snippets of some of the spaces i rendered as i talk you through them so i've been rendering this city um like it's not even a, well, it's more so like a city slash seaside apartment kind of place, like a, a home. And what I've tried to do is almost make every little room in the house different. Usually you've got like a theme running through a ho like a home, usually. Um, but with this space, I really wanted to implement different styles throughout. So one of my favourites is the entryway. I'll pop that back on the screen. It's literally got like this dark, but dark vibe but it's still bright and i love it it's I, I decided to go for like a tiling on the floor like a 
a dark marble tiling and I really am obsessed. So I've done that. Um, I went, I've done like an, another sitting room because I've already done the kitchen slash dining slash living area, but I decided to like an extra space and that's got more like a contemporary, I'll put it here again. It's got more of a contemporary feel to it. So it's more gray. Um, it's got a lot of neutral tones. It kind of feels wabi-sabi-ish, which is one of my favorite design styles. So that's, that's that. And then I, I had like another room, which is almost like a walkthrough room. I'll pop that on the screen too. And I wanted to kind of channel a bit of, it's very feminine, actually. It feels feminine. It's got like mirrors. It's got a nordic -y feel to it, but it's also got like a modern neutral feel to it as well. So yeah, that's what I've been doing this morning. It's probably around, it's, it's approaching 12. Me and my mum are gonna go grocery shopping today. So I'll probably take you guys along on that with me. Then I have a CT scan at the hospital. Um, I've had a few problems with like my abdomen and stuff. So I'm going to get a scan for that and see what's going on with my body. So um, that's my plan then. I'm supposed to be chilling with one of my friends, one of my girls later and having a bit of a catch up. So it's, it's a nice full day um, today. So I'm gonna bring you guys along and yeah, let's enjoy the ride guys. Okay guys, so I've had a wash, I've had a shower. My mom, I don't think I've mentioned a lot about my mom on here before but um my mom is like a on time person she's on time for everything and like if she's on time and you're like even two minutes late it's a problem so i'm kind of rushing i'm not doing like a full face or anything i'm just i put a bit of powder on and i am putting some concealer under my eyes and then lip gloss. That's, that's literally what i'm doing today um got a really simple fit on i thought i'd be a bit cute but it's really simple it's just a shirt that kind of has a cut out on it and some nude cargoes so that's like the vibe today just really simple rmd kind of look but yeah we're gonna quickly finish this because like i said i'm in a rush and then i will catch up with you guys in a moment <laughs> I am all done with my face. Like I said, it was really like a simple vibe today. Plus, I'm in a rush. But I don't think I mentioned, but it was really on my mind. And I thought to mention it in this video. I remember I was speaking to my mom. And as you guys know, I left my job um, like a week ago. And my mom gave me a piece of advice because a lot of people, we can fall into fear. <clears throat> if we leave a job or we leave that place that feels like stability for us we can fall into a place of fear and then just start panic applying and I'll probably end up in the same predicament again as I was in my old place if I'm panic applying and so my mom gave me sound advice she said I want you this time around to be so intentional when you're applying for jobs because I don't want you to end up in something that you don't want to be in or we're going through the same cycle again so take your time focus on your business right now God has got you <laughs> um and be intentional when you're applying look at the job description what how much hours you actually want to spend in another job like my mom was so good with the advice and I don't we've had like a bit of friction in general like with the older generation i feel like our generation does but there's like that feeling of why are you coming out of stability for instability but one thing about my mom seeing that she's really able to she's got her views but she's also able to advise me based off of how she knows i desire to live my life and i really appreciate that about her so yeah i just thought that was that was something that i should share on here because it's a big thing and you'll probably see a bit of my mom, my mom i'm not really a camera person to be honest but Hey, how her daughter is so <laughs> um, i'll probably put a little snippet of her wow so you can see she's an amazing woman like she's such an amazing woman but yeah i just thought i'd share that i'm gonna quickly make my bed and finish getting dressed because i've still got to put my trainers and whatnot on um and then i'm gonna be going out grocery shopping with my mom so catch you guys in a bit 
here's a quick overview of the fit just in case i don't get to show it. it's literally just some simple cargoes that i got from prt they're super comfy and this it's actually a dress that i folded I, I tend to do that a lot um but i just folded this shirt dress it's quite quite a vibe and just thought why not and then i'm pairing it with some air forces that i got Let's see if we'll focus air forces that i got from asos not long ago pair it with those and i don't know what jacket yet i think i'm going to throw it over i've got a cropped green jacket let me just show you guys how to pair it with my cropped green jacket or my cropped black i don't know which one yet so let me try the green one i actually diy this one with one of my old colleagues it was actually a long jacket and then we both bought the jacket and cut it short we got some inspo from a girl i might actually do it like this this is a vibe and but i don't know if it's chilly outside so i'm thinking probably the black one this is a vibe for like a cute spring day but i think i might this is what the black one looks like this one's heavier and like as you guys know the weather in the uk if you are in the uk it's a bit atrocious so i think i might do this one only because it's a bit heavier at least then i've got something over me i might actually bring a scarf just in case but yeah i'm gonna quickly get dressed like i said because i'm in a rush and then um i'll catch you guys when i am out with my mom hey guys i got ready just in time i actually found this other jacket that i felt went better with the fit so it's all the nudes today <laughs> i put my hair up in a bit of a clip as well because i just felt like it worked better um but yeah my mom is literally here now and i'm ready just in time so catch you guys in a bit Come on, man. I'll go over there and have some fucking croissants. <laughs> yeah, man, I'll go over there and have breakfast. back home for a moment i'm just actually unpacking my shopping and my mom has kindly offered to take me to the hospital for my scan so i'm going to get unpacking and then i'm going to catch you guys a bit later <sighs> it's been a very busy day i think i might put a hoodie on as well because it's getting a bit chilly outside and we can't be hot girl all the time so yeah i'll catch you guys in a moment from having my ct scan um it was actually really fast my mom originally dropped me off and she was like make your own way home because i don't know how long you're gonna be and then my uncle persuaded her to wait but it took like two minutes for the scan so it was so quick so simple so easy i was ha panic attacking whilst having the scan i don't know why i don't know what what my mom was telling me but yeah um it's out of the way now i've literally got home my mom got me an air fryer so i'm gonna open that up and i've also got some bouquets of flowers so i'm gonna be doing a bit of that this evening um and my friend is coming over a little later but i'm gonna call my cousin hope i'll catch up as i do whilst i do all of these things so yeah i'll catch you guys in a bit okay guys so i got a bit comfortable my cousin is not picking up her phone um anyway i've got two vases this one's full up of water already and i got this one from h&m home this one's from primark home um, and i'm gonna be filling these up with my bouquets of flowers so yeah you guys are gonna watch me do that i'm gonna have a bit of fun guys Hey guys, so I kind of wanted to go into the topic of romanticizing um, and I thought why not pick the perfect moment which was me 
you know having a bit of fun with my florals here but i've i actually bought the florals originally because i'm really trying to romanticize my life a bit more especially after leaving my job i've tried to become more intentional with loving myself and you know giving myself gestures of love um and this is one of the the ways in which i've done that and i thoroughly enjoyed it and i think i'm gonna really invest into things like this it really helps keep the spark alive with myself okay guys here is my first bouquet it's a bit uneven but considering it's my first go let me just put a few of these hold on i think it's quite cute i think it's a cute one for spring i think it's a vibe what do you guys think this is the first one the other one's going to be more or less identical it's just in a different shape vase so yeah this one's for the kitchen area i'm actually contemplating putting this one in the living room i think i'm going to keep it in the kitchen for now um so let's pop that into place this is such a cute vibe absolutely obsessed now time to go on to the second one okay, so I'm really much, I'm pretty much doing the same exact thing, but just with another vase, just a different shape vase for my living room. I thought since it's like spring, well, it's not spring yet, but I feel like it's coming, spring is coming. I thought, you know what, let's give those vibes to my flowers, let's add a bit of baby's breath. I've been wanting baby's breath for the longest time, like, honestly guys, I've been wanting it for the longest, so why not implement it now? But like in the last bouquet, because I put all the baby's breath in first, I feel like the tulips didn't have a chance to like be. <laughs> so I'm gonna um, add them simultaneously. A lot of the tulips leaves, I'll just peel off because I just feel like the excess, it's just excess to me. Like why, why yeah, you know. I love tulips though, I think tulips are beautiful. I feel like they're probably like my favorites after white roses. Actually, no, I think I like peonies. White peonies are definitely my thing. Um, but after those, I'd definitely say tulips are high up there, for sure. Okay, guys, it's a bit dark, as you can see, it's the evening. I don't know what time it is. I never know what time it is for some reason. I believe it's like 6 p.m., though. Um, today has been very, very busy. You would have last seen me um, doing a bit of floral arrangements in the house. I think I'm getting more into like florals and like greenery and flowers and I don't know, just romanticizing life a bit more. Um, so I've done a bit of that. I was going to open up my air fryer, but I don't know if I can be bothered. I think I'm going to because I need to eat something today and I'm thinking of some form of oven food and I might as well test out the air fryer with by doing that. Um, so if I do open it, I'll definitely be showing you guys. I'm actually shattered and I feel like the day's done, but it's not. <laughs> um, so it's 6pm currently. Like I said, I'm going to see if I can open the air fryer and potentially put some oven food in there. My house is a bit of a mess at the moment because halfway through the day, me, my mum and my uncle, which would have probably seen the montage, we went to Sainsbury's, we went to Tesco, went to like supermarkets and went grocery shopping together. Halfway through when my mum said, oh, I'll drop you to the hospital um, for my scan. She said, let's bring you home first so that we can drop off all of your groceries. So I kind of rushed back in, put a hoodie on, because like I said, it was getting a bit chilly outside and um, packed away some of the groceries, but not all of them. So it's a bit of a mess. And I'm trying to pluck up the motivation to pack stuff away. And I also need to take the bins out, so yeah it just kind of feels like a lot to do and i feel like i haven't had a moment to just go and breathe so i'm gonna try and breathe for like two or three minutes and then i'm going to neaten up because the mess is actually really frustrating me so i'm gonna neaten up pack away the shopping see if i want to open the air fryer like i said if i do i'll put you guys bring you guys in on that so yeah it's a very full day there's a lot going on um it's a good day but it's just a full day it's a long day um so yeah you about to open this.
good evening people good evening i think we have come to the end of the vlog <laughs> take these off because i feel like the reflection is wild so i'm shattered it has been such a long day you guys have come along majority of the day with me it's been really long and in all honesty today i feel like i really forgot about my basic needs once again like in regard to eating and stuff so i feel like i need to get better at that um i mean i did bake some cookies which was cute but yeah um i'm gonna call it a night it's gonna be the last bit of the vlog i'm gonna have a shower now and wind down for bed and get a really solid night's sleep tomorrow i really want to go to primark and look up a few things i don't know what's come over me but all of a sudden i want to like minimalize everything in my living room and i go through this like in seasons guys i don't know if it's a thing because i'm into interior design or what but i get these urges to always always change my um my living room or like my bedroom or whatever space i'm sitting in at the time that i'm having the epiphany about i just get this weird urge to change so i'm gonna go to primark tomorrow and look at some things and look at side tables and things like that in different stores and um, but that's that's for tomorrow today i'm done i need to go to sleep thank you guys so so much for watching this video i uh, hope that you guys are enjoying the vlogs let me know if you prefer longer vlogs shorter vlogs let me know what if you'd like me to talk about anything in particular leave it down below i'll be seeing you guys in the next video bye